are being killed and men slaughtered mercilessly. But unfortunately, the Pakistan government has been very quiet and silent in regards to all the target killing that has happened. It's no longer target killing, it's a genocide. We, this needs to stop and this needs, we need to condemn this target killing of Shia. It has happened many times during the last year. It has happened in the same city again, against the same Shia Hazara community again. Where is the UN? Where is the Human Rights Watch? Where is the Pakistan government to raise their voice and to bring some changes, to bring peace to our people? Australia is very concerned about the number of arrivals to Australia um, and if they really want to decrease the number, they really need to put pressure on uh, Pakistan government about the basic human rights of Hazaras. They need to put pressure on Pakistan government to provide safety and security for those people so they do not flee constantly to other countries like Australia. The Australian government is complicit with the Pakistani government and the outrages that are going on in places like Quetta because we know that Australian money is funding the measures that are trapping Hazara people in Pakistan and preventing them escaping danger, all because the Australian government is so desperate to avoid them coming here in order to make claims on our protection. Australia should welcome Hazara refugees as it should welcome all others. We should process them when they arrive here on asylum boats in the community. We should give them the support they need to live decently while we're assessing their refugee application. And we should promptly give them the support and the care they desperately need. Close Nauru, close Manus Island, close Millerwood, process Hazara refugee application here in the community. Give people the protection they need 